You want to talk pretentious, look at this hack, David Filoni. I've seen Bad Batch, I've seen Clone Wars. Bad Batch is garbage. Republic Commando ripoff. Clone Wars is overrated as hell. And used by Plinkett fanboy prequel hating dicks who trash the prequels but then dick riot Clone Wars. That show is so overrated. They don't even appreciate the prequels. That's where it came from. Bad Batch is terrible. Clone Wars is overrated. Rebels is worse. Dave Filoni is overrated. He disregarded episodes 1 through 3. He disregarded the Star Wars universe and its characters. He even disregarded the expanded universe and this is the so called apprentice my sweet and sour ass he can kiss it cause bitch he's the most overhyped hack in all of Star Wars so tired of prequel haters dick riding Clone Wars and saying it's shitty and Filoni's so brilliant my ass he's fucking overrated Clone Wars forces maturity at the last second without any build up Rebels forces it even worse you don't have to abide by the expanded universe you want to make your own stories that's fine but the stories you're making are disappointing and underwhelming and empty. And yet people put him up like he's suddenly the savior of Star Wars when he's not even George Lucas's apprentice and even went against George Lucas when he wanted to. That's not what a friend of George Lucas would do. He doesn't care. He just cares about what he wants, period. These new shows are terrible. Tales of the Jedi sucks. Ripping off the name of the original and shitting on great characters like Count Dooku and Qui-Gon Jinn. Their personalities are gone. The same thing they accuse them of being in the prequels is how they are thanks to Dave Filoni, the savior of Star Wars. Did you know he liked the last ass fart? I mean the last train wreck. Let that sink in really deep. Now... You're not going to tell me Bad Batch is not some bots version of Republic Commando. Clone Wars fixed the prequels my ass. All that great dialogue and great moments go beyond that show and are never acknowledged. Bad Batch, that bots show. Republic Commando had a deeper story with better characters. The Bad Batch crew have no complexity at all. They are just character archetypes with no development whatsoever. They're bland and hollow the republic commando crew were cool and full of charm and depth and had great dialogue rebels forces maturity at the last second with no prior buildup. chorus had this issue too but it's way and i repeat way worse in rebels <sighs> Clone Wars did that shit later seasons. Rebels forced that shit later seasons. These mature moments felt earned in the movies. In these shows, it did not feel earned. This pretentious ass hack. He's so freaking overrated and doesn't deserve it. Kiss my ass, David Filoni. You're a hack. They couldn't even uphold the six films after decanonizing the EU. Does that make sense to you? Fun movies, my ass. Yeah, it's fun shitting all over an entire legacy. So much fun. This average bland ass shit, get the fuck out my face. These movies are a disgrace. They disregarded everything that happened in the six films. There's only one continuity, one timeline. So you betray that timeline, you betray the entire story. And it becomes invalidated. These movies are a problem. They are literally the symbol of everything wrong with Star Wars right now. You gotta say something about it. Now, they have spinoffs. You say something, they have no choice but to start thinking and working on changes. Where do you go after this? There's nowhere to go after this. This is like the ending of an entire trilogy. Sequel fans need to shut up because, again, they always get to trash on the prequels, talking shit, bashing on those movies, and even bashing on the expanded universe. 
And what's with Force Dyads being shoehorned into the prequels? The Force was originally the light, it's balance. Yin and yang, the dark side is in balance, period. Now, they are one in the same, meaning there's no difference. Some generic yin and yang bullshit, so awful. And it was forced when there was, it was never added to those films. Prequels get shed on, but sequel fans would a dick riot, Clone Wars, and the sequels, horse shit. All the great moments and dialogue get thrown away because we got a Hear it from these haters. They're all hypocrites. Because when people bring up the sequels, which invalidated the previous six films, when that's all you had to do was uphold it, since you decanonized the EU, those people are hypocrites because they don't want their precious shitty shit talked about. But they get this shit on the prequels. Suck my dick. Then, even though they hate on the prequels, people like the Goldman use George Lucas when they feel like it, when they shat all over him. The prequels, such hypocrites. Goldman even stated, Lucas would hate you for shitting on the new movies. Fuck you. George came out and spoke about the lack of originality, so fuck off, Goldman. Oh, we're just trying to impress those fans. The original trilogy ripoff, because they made The Force Awakens. Which then copied the original trilogy. So they probably thought to themselves, Oh, we tried to give you what you want by copying the original trilogy. No, we wanted something brand new. You don't just copy the original trilogy. See, they had their own mindset for the fan base. And it backfired because they thought upholding it was copying. Then disregarding because after copying, people thought that was whack. So now they're like, well, we tried, but you... Lashed out, not realizing you fucking copied. You didn't do shit new. That's where the backlash came from. And the irony, they were reaching out to that fan base the whole time just to appease the same fans that were going against you anyway. Do to what you did because you ended up telling them to disregard it because they got tired of people bringing up the fact that all you did was copy the original trilogy. Oh, we were just trying to impress those fans. Fans. So they didn't even do a good job with that. All you did was copy it. Thank you so much to everyone who's here. If you'd like to join in, the bell notification is there for a reason. I love y'all, man. Thank you so much for the support you've shown me. And I am now out this piece. Thank you so much.